we've all received a bouquet of flowers as a gift or gone by the grocery store and thought I can put together a bouquet for something that I have going on. This one that I'm going to do is going to be a one-sided arrangement so it'll have basically a flat back and it'll go against a wall um, so that it's mostly viewed from the front. I've got different shaped flowers to work with. This is one that's more tall and spiky and it'll work in the very top of a one-sided arrangement and this one's a larger flower that would make the good focal point for a smaller arrangement. And then we have several different flowers that are going to fill in the arrangement. Some people will start with their greenery to kind of give them a grid work to work within inside their vase, or you can make a grid work with tape across the top of the vase. You can put your focal flower in first and that gives you an idea of uh, where you're beginning to work towards and a view of the focal point of the arrangement. And then you can begin to add other flowers to fill in your arrangement with those smaller flowers. One other key point is you don't want to have any of your um, leaf material under the water as it just adds to the bacteria that can grow and the, the life of the bouquet will be shortened. As you're creating your arrangement, you kind of want to base it off of the center of the arrangement and do things balanced on both sides of the arrangement. For the University of Wyoming Extension, I'm Donna Hoffman and this is From the Ground Up.